So this is my brand new watercolor paint pad set. It comes with a whole little kit here. As you can see, it has this watercolor palette with 36 different watercolors in it. It comes with three brushes, one pencil here, but I'm gonna be using mine today. And then it also has a water pen, which is really cool. And then it also has this little eraser down here. I don't know if you can see that. It comes with this really thick um, watercolor book. It has 60 pages uh, for painting in it. And then I also got this 40 piece brush set and I'm gonna be using this guy a lot today too. Um, all of these supplies were fairly inexpensive. I think each one was like $9.95 at Sam's Club and I found them on their website So I'm gonna go ahead and link them down below, but you don't necessarily have to get them from there You can honestly get all of this stuff at like Michael's craft store. All right, so I'm gonna start by opening this guy up here I think it looks like it opens right here Look how cool this water pen is. So you just open it up, you fill up the inside, and then you can just use the water. This is really, really cool and really helpful if you are traveling on the go. I'm not gonna use it today though, so I'm just gonna keep it in here. And then we have these brushes here. So these are the brushes that it comes with. It looks like mine got a little smashed, but that's okay and then a pencil. So the brushes that I'm gonna be using, I just put in a mason jar because I don't wanna get this dirty because I'm actually gonna use this for something else other than my paint brushes. So I'm gonna put this away. We're gonna put these guys right here. This is what the front page looks like. I'm thinking I wanna like cover it with stickers and decorate it later, but this is the first page of my journal that I'm gonna be doing. I'm so excited. Also, please ignore this fingernail. Um, I jammed it in the refrigerator and the gel polish came off and then it bruised up. So that's why <laughs> she's looking like that. The tape does not lift up any of the paper when I go to take it off, but we'll see how it works out. <laughs>
So I'm going to take off the tape now and I'm kind of nervous and hoping that it doesn't like rip the page so cross your fingers. Okay so the tape did a number on this corner. 
to be honest, I feel like it makes it look a little more artsy anyway, but like, ugh.